What's up guys, it's Real Deal Minecraft bringing you another episode of Real Deal Minecraft. Today we're going to be going over our digital clock display that I just got finished with. I did all the testing that I said I was going to do and I also added a few new features that I'm pretty proud of. I thought I wasn't going to go all out on it, but I happened to do that, so it's twice as big pretty much right now. But overall, I'm really proud of it. It's all done right now, just a few timing things need to be done but uh... that's it and i'll tell you about that later but anyway i created a minecart that goes all the way up to it and you can see all the wiring and stuff it's pretty cool and it comes into this room where the display is so i made everything in the background black so that you could see it better and if you stand on this red dot just perfectly it looks really nice and there's also another display right there to get the 10 hours so you can add your hours and minutes just like before so let's just make it like 8 o'clock like that 807 it should be 807 I'm pretty sure let's just let it update and there you go 807 is now displayed and you can also start and stop the clock from here just like before but now it's easier just by standing in one spot and every minute it'll change and goes up and it's pretty accurate right now so if you guys want to test this out go ahead and download the world save file but I'm also here to show you the new and improved um, feature in it and that is a stopwatch so if you come over here there's a lever right here and it asks you if you want the stopwatch on or off and if you turn it on all these displays turn to zero well it's supposed to be zero one is five it's, that's because it was on for a little bit so if we reset it back to zero 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 that light goes off everything should reset back to zero and the light comes on when you can proceed so you can start it by pressing this button and I'm gonna warn you guys there is some timing errors like when the first cell changes from nine to zero and then the second cell is supposed to turn to one it is a little bit off as you'll see but it goes up every second and sometimes it lags but it's alright and this is what I'm talking about the one is kind of lagged there it is so I'm going to have to do some timing stuff and that shouldn't be too hard but basically that's what it is and there is quite a delay on stopping and starting it but basically it goes up to 59 minutes and 59 seconds so you can also reset it again just like this and it should all reset back to zero just like that and we can go back to the clock like this and the clock can also be running like this as we have this on it just won't be displayed and the decimals in the background I don't have it blinking on the stopwatch when it's running but I do have it blinking when the clock is going so that just tells you that the clock is running even when you're on the stopwatch and you can also do the stopwatch and this might be pretty laggy because of all the things that has to happen with the redstone of but basically you can play with the stopwatch and have the time running at the same time and see it, it jumps a lot right now just because I'm recording and two big things are going on at the same time and we can reset it once again we'll go back to our clock and hopefully a minute's gone by and you guys can see that the clock was still running well I mean it has not gone by but trust me on this guys it should change to 8 you know sometime soon so basically this is my clock I'm really proud of it there you go guys it changed to 8 I hope you're happy but remember please download the save file watch the videos I'm gonna be coming up with more stuff but basically this project was my longest and biggest project ever and it was definitely the most annoying project um... i'll just give you a quick glance of the back of it where the stopwatch is i had the watch the actual clock in front of it 
and then the stopwatch is back here behind it. So here's the stopwatch and the clock is behind me and it's really cool. Just got done with this. All we have to do is just some timing stuff. So I'll put the updated version of this in my channel as well as in the description box. So that's it guys. Have a nice day.